So this is an amazing cast, of course, yes, with even is. more amazing hair. Right. But I think right. yours takes the prize. You think so? Yeah. All I mean, right. what would you think? What would you say? Yeah, it was pretty pretty uh, tremendous. Uh, it uh, took a lot of work to <laughs> to make that thing. Happen. Yeah, what is it like getting that thing on you? It was my hair. You know, so like, it was is that just, your real hair? Yeah, yeah. Oh, wow. Yeah. I was convinced I was a wig. Yeah, I know. A lot of people thought That's that. That's amazing. Yeah. <laughs> so you lived your life for a few months with that? <laughs> in a hat. <laughs> pretty much. In a hat. <laughs> pretty much in a hat, son. I mean, you've done a lot of action roles of late, mm-hmm. you know, a lot of franchise-type flicks. Is it is it a little, is it more fun to d- dive into something like this that's a little more grounded? For me as an actor, yes. Yeah, I mean, don't get me wrong, I love I love the, the big movies and, and the stunt aspect of it, but to really dive into real true character with, I think, one of the masters of character, which is David, um, and it's a pure, pure joy and pleasure, you know. And then there's tremendous... Um, Actors to dance with, like, come on, it's a pretty amazing cast. I felt pretty honored. And really interesting characters. And yours yeah. is almost the most morally upstanding. And everybody right. around you is kind of very right. questionable and borderline <laughs> insane. Yeah, yeah. What was it like developing your character amongst these actors who are going like? It was, well it was tough time? because it's quite separated from what their all their uh, you know stuff is happening in the, in the movie. It's a, for my character, I just kind of just be blind to a lot of things and just be wide-eyed and, I don't want to say naive, but for me as the actor, I had to kind of like just shut off to all their their their, their dramas. Yeah. Um, and just be like, you know, the good mayor. Do you look at any like political figures when you're doing the research or preparing? A real, the real guy, um, Angelo Arachetti. I looked, I looked to him for pretty much most of the emotional behavior, or at least the, the drive, uh, and who he was uh, in principle. Yeah. And then I looked to a few others um, as well, and I had to speak to quite a few because politics is not my bag. And that was probably the most challenging aspect of the movie for me, is um, having to improvise in political jargon. And it was really, it's like literally improvising in a, in a foreign language. Um, it's quite tough for me, so um, I had to spend time with congressmen and, and that sort of thing. So. Every scene looks like it was super fun to shoot, mm. a lot of energy on yeah, set. Yeah. Which yeah. which scene for you stood out as, as being the most uh, gratifying? I, I think they all were, um, they were all electric, you know? Um, probably two of them that I'm thinking of aren't, aren't in the movie. Oh, yeah. Um, but there are, you know, every scene was just alive and electric and, uh, and you know, um, and they turned out great. You won't remember this, but you were my first celebrity interview. I did a phoner with you for 28 weeks later. Oh, which yeah? Was like six <laughs> years ago or something. Yeah, yeah, 2006 or something. Yeah, a yeah. lot's changed since then. A lot's not, changed. Not for me, but for Right, you. right. <laughs> what is What has that journey been like since then? You know, I mean, the their stature has just skyrocketed. Hey, man, it's great to, to work. And, and that that's... Uh, the only thing for me that's changed is like I feel like I'm, I'm working, and that that feels really great, man. It's a great honor to to do what I love to do, cool. and that you're still doing it, and making I'm it happen. I'm still doing it. That, that's pretty <laughs> We've great. Come full circle. Yeah, yeah, I love it.